Hosanna to the son of David, the king of Israel. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. Welcome to our service online for Palm Sunday. Uh, we've gathered in our prayer space outside, Robin and I, uh, with a palm front to begin this celebration of Palm Sunday. The Lord be with you and also with you. We begin this morning the great week of the Christian year. During Lent we have been preparing for the celebration of our Lord's death and resurrection by prayer and works of love and self-denial. Today we come together with the church throughout the world to call to mind and to express in word and action our Lord's Passover from death to life, which is the centre of the Easter mystery. Today we greet him as our King, Though we know his crown is thorns and his throne a cross, we follow him this week from the glory of the palms to the glory of the resurrection by way of the dark road of suffering and death. United with him in his suffering on the cross, may we share his resurrection and new life. We pray. Blessed are you, Almighty God, whose Son Jesus Christ entered in triumph into the holy city to complete his work as our Messiah. May this branch, these branches, be signs of the victory of your Son. May we who carry them in his name ever hail him as our King and follow him in the way that leads to eternal life, who now lives and reigns in glory with you and the Holy Spirit, now and forever. Amen. The children of the Hebrews, bearing branches of olives, went out to meet the Lord, crying out and saying, Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. A reading from Matthew, chapter 21, beginning at the first verse. When they had come near Jerusalem and had reached Bethphage at the Mount of Olives, Jesus sent two disciples, saying to them, Go into the village ahead of you, and immediately you will find a donkey tied and a colt with her. Untie them and bring them to me. If anyone says anything to you, just say this, The Lord needs them, and he will send them immediately. This took place to fulfil what had been spoken through the prophet, saying, Tell the daughter of Zion, Look, your king is coming to you, humble and mounted on a donkey, and a colt, the foal of a donkey. The disciples went and did as Jesus had directed them. They brought the donkey and the colt, and put their cloaks on them, and he sat on them. A very large crowd spread their cloaks on the road, and others cut branches from the trees and spread them on the road. The crowds that went ahead of him and that followed were shouting, Hosanna to the Son of David! Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord! Hosanna in the highest heaven! When he entered Jerusalem, the whole city was in turmoil, asking, Who is this? The crowds were saying, This is the prophet Jesus from Nazareth in Galilee. Let us pray. Merciful God, as we enter this holy week and gather at your house of prayer, turn our hearts again to Jerusalem, to the life, death and resurrection of Jesus Christ, that united with Christ and all the faithful, we may one day enter in triumph the city not made with hands, the new Jerusalem, eternal in the heavens, where with you and the Holy Spirit Christ lives in glory forever. Amen. Let us go forth praising Jesus our Messiah. In the name of Christ. Amen.
everlasting God, in your tender love for the human race, you sent your Son to take our nature and to suffer death upon the cross. In your mercy, enable us to share in his obedience to your will and in the glorious victory of his resurrection through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God for ever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and also with you. The Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to Matthew, the 27th chapter, beginning at the 11th verse. Glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Now Jesus stood before the governor, and the governor asked him, Are you the king of the Jews? Jesus said, You say so. But when he was accused by the chief priests and elders, he did not answer. Then Pilate said to him, Do you not hear how many accusers they may have against you? But he gave them no answer, not even a single charge, so that the governor was greatly amazed. Now at the festival, the governor was accustomed to releasing a prisoner for the crowd, anyone whom they wanted. At that time, they had a notorious prisoner called Jesus Barabbas. So after they had gathered, Pilate said to them, Whom do you want me to release for you? Jesus Barabbas or Jesus, who's called the Messiah? for he realised that it was out of jealousy that they had handed him over. While he was sitting on the judgment seat, his wife sent word to him, have nothing to do with that innocent man, for today I have suffered a great deal because of a dream about him. Now the chief priests and the elders persuaded the crowds to ask for Barabbas, and to have Jesus killed. The governor again said to them, which of the two do you want me to release for you? And they said, Barabbas. Pilate said to them, then what should I do with Jesus, who was called the Messiah? All of them said, let him be crucified. Then he asked, why? What evil has he done? But they shouted all the more, Let him be crucified. So when Pilate saw that he could do nothing, but rather that a riot was beginning, he took some water and washed his hands before the crowd, saying, I am innocent of this man's blood. See to it yourselves. Then the people as a whole answered, His blood will be on us and on our children. So he released Barabbas for them, and after flogging Jesus, he handed him over to be crucified. Then the soldiers of the governor took Jesus into the governor's headquarters, and they gathered the whole cohort around him. They stripped him and put a scarlet robe on him, and after twisting some thorns into a crown, they put it on his head. They put a reed in his right hand and knelt before him and mocked him, saying, Hail, King of the Jews! They spat on him and took the reed and struck him on the head. After mocking him, they stripped him of the robe and put his own clothes on him. Then they led him away to be crucified. As they went out, they came upon a man from Cyrene named Simon. They compelled this man to carry his cross. And when they came to a place called Golgotha, which means place of the skull, they offered him wine to drink, mixed with gall, but when he tasted it, he would not drink it. And when they had crucified him, they divided his clothes amongst themselves by casting lots, 
Then they sat down there and kept watch over him. Over his head they put the charge against him which read, This is Jesus, the King of the Jews. Then two bandits were crucified with him, one on his right and one on his left. Those who passed by derided him, shaking their heads and saying, You who would destroy the temple and build it in three days, save yourself. If you are the Son of God, come down from the cross. In the same way, the chief priests also, along with the scribes and elders, were mocking him, saying, He saved others, and he cannot save himself. He is the King of Israel. Let him come down from the cross now, and we will believe in him. He trusts in God. Let God deliver him now, and we will believe in him. He trusts in God if he wants to, for he said, I am God's son. The bandits who were crucified with him also taunted him in the same way. From noon on, darkness came over the whole land until three in the afternoon. And about three o'clock, Jesus cried with a loud voice, Eli, Eli, lemma sabbathatha, that is, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? When some of the bystanders heard it, they said, this man is calling for Elijah. At once one of them ran and got a sponge, filled it with sour wine, put it on a stick and gave it to him to drink. But the others said, Wait, let us see whether Elijah will come to save him. Then Jesus cried again with a loud voice and breathed his last. At that moment, the curtain of the temple was torn in two from top to bottom. The earth shook and the rocks were split. The tomb also were opened, and many bodies of the saints who had fallen asleep were raised. After his resurrection, they came out of the tomb and entered the holy city and appeared to many. But when the centurion and those with him who were keeping watch over Jesus saw the earthquake and what took place, they were terrified and said, Truly this man was God's son. This is the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. On Palm Sunday, as you've just heard, uh, Jesus entered Jerusalem in triumph. It wasn't Jesus' first time in Jerusalem. He had been brought there as a baby to the temple on the eighth day to be circumcised. He'd been there at least once as a young person and stayed uh, as a 12-year-old in the temple to learn. He'd been there in a vision at the start of his ministry and tempted by Satan. He had renounced uh, the use of power and angels to force a takeover of the temple. And he'd been there through his teaching ministry from time to time to teach and to heal in the temple and around Jerusalem. Jerusalem in his ministry became a place of threat. Uh, people from Jerusalem want to kill you, Lord. And now here at the end of his public ministry, he goes again to Jerusalem and we reenact that on Palm Sunday. Tell the story again and in in-person church we act it out. And his entry into Jerusalem that final time is the ascent of a king to the temple. There are crowds worshipping, waving palms, shouting, Hosanna, the king of Israel. The king in Old Testament thinking 
was the one who ordered the world for God and the temple was the place where God was worshipped and present. And so the king going to the temple, Hosanna, God's agent is coming to God's place. All is well, a triumphant entry. But interestingly, on that entry into Jerusalem, he renounces the use of power and the use of violence. He turns up on a donkey and those who welcome him are the poor. He's not using force. He's not using the miracle of power he's got. He's not using angels. He's not bringing an army. He's just coming to offer the kingdom of love and grace again to everybody there. On entering Jerusalem, he heads to the temple. And this reading that you've heard stops before this, but in Matthew's Gospel, uh, he immediately, on arriving in the temple, cleanses the traders out, those who've corrupted it as a space for worship, and cleanses it for God. And then he spends the rest of that week teaching in the temple. And some of his parables uh, are parables of grace and judgment, and parables of discernment. Because what he did in that last week, what he did in that entry, was make a final appeal to the religious leaders in Jerusalem and the people of the temple and Jerusalem to turn to Christ, to acknowledge that God had come in Jesus, not as expected, but as God chose. He's making a final appeal to Jerusalem. What happened in that last week, as he taught, was that their resolution to dispose of him hardened and his appeal turned into their judgment. Them thinking they were judging and disposing of him. It led to Good Friday. In fact, their judging of him would in time turn out to be their judging of themselves as they turned out to be faithless murderers of God. In a sense, his final appeal, that entry and that last week of teaching, provoked their response, set off the train of events that led to Good Friday and exposed the darkness of their hearts. We tell the story of Palm Sunday to begin Holy Week in the Christian year. We dramatically tell the story of Jesus entering Jerusalem and then through Holy Week, particularly on the Friday and the Saturday, the Thursday, uh, we will dramatically again tell the story of what Jesus did back then. And we'll listen to that story. We don't encounter Holy Week today the way Jesus' first hearers did, as untaught disciples or as evil people whose evil will be exposed. Uh, we encounter Holy Week as disciples who want to know more who want to be true to the call that God has on our lives, who want uh, to see the justice and love of God prevail in our world, we encounter Holy Week, which we begin now, as disciples. But we too will be read by the story. The story will expose us and show us as people who yearn or as people who are half-hearted or as people who need to start again. And when we come to make our baptism promises again on Easter Day, uh, we will have been exposed by the story. And when we're asked, do you turn to Christ? Our response might be yes for the first time. I turn to Christ. Our response might be, I'm going to keep turning to Christ. But I hope with a sense of joy. Not I ought or I've done the maths and this is what I need to do, but... I actually do turn to Christ. I actually do repent of my sins. I actually do want to live as a disciple. So as Jesus, by his entry into Jerusalem and by teaching, uh, exposed the real character of the people of his day, so may this Holy Week inspire thirst in us for God, for holiness, for usefulness in God's service but mostly to know Christ more. Amen. Ubutumwa bwiza tubusanga muri Matayo mweranda ikigabure ca 221. Bageze hafi Yerusalemu bashikira ibetifage ku musozi wa Yerayono 
Yesu atuma bigishwa babiri arababarira ati mugende muri ya mihana iri imbere yanyu muca mubona indogoba iziritse iziritseho n'inyana yayo muziziture muzinzanire ni hagira ubabaza mumubwire muti data buja ni wazigomba acha azirungika ibyo byabayeho ku ngo byavuzwe n'uwavugishwa n'Imana bishike ngo mubwire umukobwa wi Siyoni mutirabo umwami wawe aje kuri wewe ari umutekerezi agendera ku ndogoba mbere ni kumukangara inyana y'indogoba abigishwa baragenda babigenza nkuko Yesu yababwiye bazana indogoba n'inyana yayo bazisasa ku impuzu zabo yicarako Abenshi mu ishengero basasa impuzu zabo mu nzira abandi baca amashami y'ibiti bayasasa mu nzira kandi ishengero rimugiye imbere niri mukurikiye risemera riti hoziana umwana wa Dawidi hashemejwe hashemezwe uje mu izina ry'uhoraho hoziana mu ijuru ashitsi ya rusaremu igisagara cyose kirashwa baduka barabaza barabazanya bati uyo ninde abo mu ishengero barabishura bati uyo nuvugishwa n'Imana Yesu wi Nazareti igariraya Yesu yinjiye i Yerusalemu kuwa Mungu bisanda sanda mu buryo bwo kwimikwa nk'umwami ugiye kwimikwa no gushigwa ku ngoma isinzi ry'abantu bamwakiriye n'abantu yari yafashije mu mirimo mu murimo wiwe Bari shimye kandi bazungagiza amashami bisanda sanda nk'amabendera kandi bamutazira Yesu yinjiye mu gisagara ku ndogoba itungo ry'umworo yakiriwe naboro kandi ntabwo yazanye ingabo kuko yara yari yaje azanwe n'urukundo rw'abantu ntabwo yaje kubagwanya Uwa Mungu w'ibisanda sanda Yari intango y'indwi ya nyuma y'ubuzima bwa Yesu. Kari uburyo busanzwe bwo kwinjira mu gisagara. Icakurikiye ko Yesu yakoze n'ukwirukana badandaza mu rusengero. Nyuma y'ivyo yakoresheje urusengero nk'ikibanza ciwe yigisha abantu. Inyigisho ziwe kuva muri iyi ndwi zirimo imburi zivuga ko abantu bagomba kwihana no kumukurikira mu gihe bagifise umwanya. Nico gihe bwa nyuma yaheruka gusaba abarongozi n'abantu ba Yerusalemu kwihana no kumukurikira Aho gukora ibyo abarongozi b'urusengero batanguye gutegura imigambi yo kwica Yesu Twabisomye kandi kubyerekeye iyo nkuru mu miga yacu y'uyu munsi Kuri twebwe indwi bisanda sanda ni ntangiriro y'indwi nyeranda Muri yindwi nyeranda dukuye gufata bibiliya zacu tugasoma inkuru ya Yesu yindwi yiwe ya nyuma inyigisho ziwe ifunguro rya nyuma ifatwa ryiwe n'urupfu rwiwe mu gihe dusoma dukuye kwibaza niba turabayoboke beza ba Yesu koko ibi bizo dufasha imyiteguro yo kwa gatano mweranda na pasika mu yindwi mu yindi ndwi zoza Kundwi kurikira tuzosubira kuvugira hamwe ko twizigira Yesu Kristo kandi tuzamukurikira hamwe twese Amina Please stand if you can for the greeting of peace We are the body of Christ his spirit is with us the peace of the Lord be always with you also with you Please with you Please with you
communities everywhere following the way of the cross this week that the passion of Christ may sustain our faith and enliven our witness to the world let us pray to the living God Lord hear our prayer we pray for the pastors teachers evangelists and prophets of the church that the wisdom of Christ may keep them grounded in the gospel. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for candidates for baptism and for the church preparing to welcome them, that the faith of Christ may gather us together at the foot of the cross. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for the nations of the world and for the peace of Jerusalem, that the kingdom of Christ may come with true peace and the forgiveness of our enemies. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for the endangered earth, where human carelessness and waste threaten the environment, that the Spirit of Christ may teach us how to care for the earth and revive our delight in creation. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for the hungry, the homeless and the outcasts of the world, that the love of Christ may teach us hospitality, hope and care for the least of our sisters and brothers. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for people whose lives are limited by sickness, grief, 
or fear, that the compassion of Christ may come to them with comfort and courage. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for all who bear the weight of others' troubles, that the easy yoke of Christ may lighten their burdens and strengthen them for service. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for people offering their lives and loving service, that the blessing of Christ may come to them and their gifts be received and remembered with joy. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for all who deny their faith or betray their friends, that the forgiveness of Christ may come to them with healing and love. Let us pray to the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for people preparing to die, that the light of Christ may shine on them both now and in the day of resurrection. Let us pray for the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. Amasengesho yomukiruni yokuri imusu w'Imana igene hizo ya kabiri z'ukwezi kwa kane umwaka wa 2023 abereye ku ishengero ya Mariko Muiranda muri Anglican hano muri Australia mana ugira neza mana yicuwahiro nushimwe nushigwe hejuru icuwahiro ni kibicawe urabikuye mana yacu turagushimiye wewe utugeje kuri ministry bazima uyu no munsi mwiza kandi waremye mwami turawunezererewe turawuhimbawe mwami nigiye kiza mwamo duhaye kugira ngo duhamagare izina ryawe ijambo rya tubwira yuko abaguhamagara bose mwami imana zo bitaba kandi ijambo rya tubwira ngo nitwa kurondera no mutima wacu wose tuzokubona mana kandi nguko ijambo rya ari tubwira kandi ngo guko kikije Yerusalemu ukikije nabantu bawe mwami nico gituma no budusubi kwicisha bugufi tugusenga guko ijambo rya tubwira ngo dusabe tuzoronka turamutse tuzokugururigwa Mwami kusaba wese ahabwa urondera wese aronka none mana yacu tuje imbere yawe dusaba imana yacu dusaba umuvyeyi wacu turazi neza yuko utubabara wamana natwe igiro numurango mwami nico gituma tubanje gusaba imbabazi ko turabanyandege nke naho tugucumura ko muvyimviro naho tugucumura ko mukuvuga ubanze duhari ibyaha byacu mwami uko kwa ni kwa gufi ngo kuna ngo kiza n'amatwi yawe ndi yapfuye ngo narwe kumva ariko wamuteza amatwi kugira ngo wumvirize amasengesho yacu mwami none uduharire imitima yacu kubereka imbazi mwami wakira amasengesho yacu mana yacu turagushima yuko Yesu Kristo wemeye ukitanga mwami mana ngo ntabwo wigeze wumira ku mana naho ari imana waremeye uza mu isi uremera wisigubusa Mwami uwambwa ku musaraba urakubitwa uwambwa igitsibo cy'amahwa ibyo byose byabaye kurya jambo ryawe mwami mana bitubwira yuko uko kurukuru wakunza bari mwisi aje cyatumye witanga kugira ngo kwizera wese ndaza ferubi ariko azahabwa ubwo budashira turagushima mana yacu yuko ibyo byose mwami mana wabikoze gushaka kwawe turagushaka turagushima mwami mana yuko urukundo wadukunze mwami utagira uko tworugereranya mwami none mana yacu kuko watuguze mwami jabo yatugira ngo twaguzwe twaguzwe ku buntu mwami watuguze igiciro cy'amaraso yawe Yesu none mwami mana waducunguje amaraso yawe turabigushimiye mwami none uheza uduheza gire utugirire neza mwami na cyane cyane muri iki gihe turi mu mwami twame twibuka imibaro wagize twame twibuka mwami imana kwitanga witanze mwami twitangira uko ijambo rya tubwira ngo tukira abanyandege nke wadupfiriye mwami turabanyandege nke wadupfiriye turabanyabyaha mwami 
wikorera imitwaro yacu wikorera ibyaha byacu uba tubuhora mwami gira bakwizera bose mwami babe abaragwa bawe babana bawe mwami none turabigushimiye imana yacu none mana tukiri muri yisi turakwinginze guduhe gusa nawe yesu uduhe uko tubereye karorero mwami uko ari we nzira no kuri nubugingo uduhe kugendera mu byigomba mwami Mwe muwawe arushirize ko twereka mwami kutwigisha dushirize ubwira twama imbuto twama imbuto zo kuyana no kugororoka mwami twama ibyamwa turogogwa na mwe muwawe yera uko ajya mugira tubwira ngo abarongogwa na mwe muyera ni bo bana b'Imana none natwe mwami turagomba kurongogwa nawe kugira ngo dushirize turushirize uko ibyo ugomba mwami turushirize uko ama imbuto zikwiranye mwami mana no kuyana ugororoka urukundo amahoro umunezero kugira neza mana yacu nibindi 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 mwami tugire dukora ibyigomba mwami ubukoze mana yacu ndasengeye imitima yacu mwami nukuri turi mwisi imisi rimwe satani n'isi rimwe mageragezwa ariko turazi neza yuko mwami we uriho kandi uri imana kandi zokwa mu witwa imana kandi ngo nta cyatugerageje akarisho dushobora kwihanganira ne mana yacu dufashe tubandanye urugendo mwami ujane natwe mana yacu uhoza nabwa bukuga rwa bisirayeli turagomba natwe mwami ubane natwe aba mu ijoro haba kumutaga ugende dukingira imyambi wa mwa satana agenda turasa kugira ngo tubandanye urugendo mana yacu uzobukoze utugirire neza nutunganye mwami utugirire neza mwami uturushize uko abera kuko na uruwera mwami Uza naho za gutuza zira gutorishengero yawe Yesu tuze tukubone muri ibya yaririri ibye mwami aravuga ati Yesu ndaciye ku rukundo wahunze mwami none tero aciye ku rukundo wadukunze mwami urukundo wadukunze gurusumu kwezi rusumu izuba bone kuje muri shikayo none mana yacu tugirire neza turushye ubwendera muri ubwo rukundo gwawe ubuntu bwawe butwomeko ndubazi zawe zitwomeko mwami turushye ubwendera dukora ibyigomba mana urakoze kwa duheza nyie urakoze kwa tugiriye neza mwami turagusabye ngo imbazi zawe zirushye kutuba ko mwami ubwiza bwawe burabagirane hirya no hino mwami udukikiza impande zose mwami kugira ngo satane mwami imana ntabe twara kayomekera turushye kuba muri wewe nawe wo muri twebwe mwami mana yacu waremeye urabazwa waremeye gukisha bugufi mwami ijambo ryo tubira ngo tujutuma mana yacu imana yagushize hejuru kugira ngo amavyi yose azapfukame mu izina ryawe mwami indimba zindi zosemerere mwami ngo Yesu rumukiza natwe duhe kumenya ko rumukiza wacu mwami mana yacu turagushima mbere yuko wagende yo kunyana indogo wango byaravuzwe mwami ego mana yacu abakwizera mwami bagasasa impunzi zikira ku ndogo ukagendera ko byaravuzwe abakwizera bagasasa ego ni amabashisha ama bibi gazi mwamu kagendera ko mu izina rya Yesu natwe ndakwinginze mwami utegura imitima yacu mwami ikubere indogoba ikubere mwami imana icicaro wa muba mu mitima yacu mwami dasenge ishengero ryawe dasenge yabarusho dasenge yabagwaye dasenge yabananiwe dasenge yabihebuye mwami mu izina rya Yesu uje kutugendera dasenge n'igihe turi mu mwami n'igihe kiboneye kitoroshe mwami ubundi mana yacu we wa muruti guri kutugirira neza kandi mana wa yoturemye kutugira tugukorere tukuvuge tukuririmbire tugusenge ariko satana agenda tuguhisha mwami none twasenge mwana yacu gira ngo urushire kurinda imitima yacu twigumire muri we nawe muri twebwe mwami urakoze amahoro yawe gaze mu mitima yacu mu mitima yacu mwami urushire gukora ibigomba mwami urakoze mana turaduhikije impande zose mana yacu uri kumwe natwe nkuko muri mirimbi yavuze mana yacu uje jambo rya wari tubwira wa mana natwe ugendana natwe mwami udukikije impande zose none duheza gire uturinde mwami turazi mana yacu kwice kuya ntebe yawe ibabazi uracahamagara mwami none muze mwese mwami kwa mu witegure kutugirira ikigongwe none mana yacu turaje uduheza gire mana uzo gukoze indwe utubere zuri mugisha mwami e i paskizi tubere mwami mana icitegererezo mwami twibukuru kundu wadukunze mwami 
Nibo fuzili bia habiachu, kibuze kwa alzuze mngami, kibuze kwa duze mngijuru mngami, kani nubu uche mjibu gadata, ura dusengira, ura koze mngami, ura koze mana yachu, tusawabikieya, alibu kwa duhabishi, uikule kuhu gomba, mwizina jayesu kristu mchungu juwachu, amen. Accept our prayers through Jesus Christ our Lord, who taught us to pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Well, thanks once again for joining us for worship here on Palm Sunday. I hope that it's been a good time to remember uh, the story for you and that you're aware that this is the start of Holy Week and that you use this Holy Week well to reflect on the story of Jesus and God's call on our life. Can I suggest that this week you read at least one of the Passion stories privately, the stories of Jesus' death from Matthew, Mark, Luke or John, which one doesn't matter, but take some time to read out loud on your own and see what strikes you and inspires you from it. Can I invite you to join us here online again for Good Friday? The Good Friday service will be released a bit after seven o'clock, as you would expect if you've been following our channel, and the Easter Day service will be released on Easter Day, again a bit after seven o'clock. At Good Friday, we'll remember that Christ died for us and reflect on the meaning of that. And on Easter Sunday, we'll remember that he rose and we'll renew our baptism promise to follow him. So thanks for joining us. I look forward to you joining us again. Lord to your faithful people pardon and peace that we may be cleansed from all our sins and serve you with a quiet mind through Christ our Lord the blessing of God Almighty Father Son and Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always amen go in peace to love and serve the Lord in the name of Christ. Amen.
Robin, I haven't worn my red stole for a while. This is the stole I was deaconed in and priested in. And you know what? I've gained a bit of weight, but it still fits. Excellent. Aren't, aren't you lucky? <laughs> <laughs>